Bunny, and I'm filming right now on my webcam again because I can. Why? Why am I doing this? I feel like I just need to balance out between like the HD quality I've been uploading and just like terrible like grainy MacBook quality, you know, just for a fair balance. Um, also, like I'm still borderline feeling like death. If you follow me on Twitter, you know last night like I got horribly, horribly just disgustingly suddenly ill. I won't go into detail. Um, but sometimes when you eat at Subway, you don't eat fresh. You eat poisonous pickle slices. So today is just gonna kind of be like a random vlog because I don't know how y'all's new year has started off so far, but mine has literally been like a bad episode of the Twilight Zone, if that existed. So I'll just give y'all a quick summary of the past like three days of my existence. I guess one of the craziest slash most tragic things that happened to me is I broke my freaking iPhone. Um, yeah, I was like driving around the other day, got a huge cherry Coke from the Sonic and like, I don't know how it happened, but I somehow like punctured the cup and this was at night and I had no idea. And normally I just like, I have two like cup holders in my car, you know, one is taller and one is like shorter. So it's just uh, you know, graduated just a little bit. And so I normally put my iPhone in the bottom cup holder and whatever I'm drinking in the top cup holder. So the cup like got a hole in it, magic. And I didn't even notice that the bottom cup holder like was like gullying up all the liquid. Um, so I took my iPhone for a swim. Um, I don't know how many of you have an OtterBox, but PS, they're not waterproof. I thought they were but they're not. So I had to get an iPhone 4S. I haven't tried it yet, but I keep wanting to try the camera because the good thing, the good thing about me breaking my phone is that now I can film in HD also on my iPhone. Basically I can film in HD on everything except for the format that I'm using now. So logic, uh, none. I didn't originally intend on buying the 4S just because like, I don't know, there's some robot in here that talks to you and I don't really know how I feel feel about that. Um, so I don't know, that is rad. Teach me how to use Siri. Somebody teach me how to use Siri because I don't know what it's for. So thanks to everybody on Facebook the other night who was telling me like all these crazy things to do with my iPhone. I did put it in the bag of rice as you can still see. Now I, this is like the rankest iPhone. Like I guess like if the 2012 Mayan calendar does happen, I can just like eat my phone as a last resort. Um, cause it must be full of like cherry soda and now like little rice granules are all stuck in it. Um, but it still won't turn on. So I don't know, it's a brick. I read online that like, if you get liquid in them, like that it'll fry it if you turn it on. And like, of course, when it happened, my phone was on. So I don't know. It was really weird because like, at first it was just totally on and it was totally fine. And I was like, oh good, nothing happened. I kind of got worried because every time I was pressing the home button, like just cherry soda was just like oozing out. And I was like, well, that can't be good. <laughs> so I guess that's really like the only bad slash crazy things that happened to me in the past year. Oh my God, this is my first video of the year, you guys. I haven't made a video since last year. That joke is so lame, but I still kind of love it. Like I've been like torturing everyone with that. I was like, we haven't talked in a year. God, you hate me. Also my contest closed and I don't even feel like making like an official separate video for that. Um, Cause I did already message the winner. So I hope she contacts me back. I also did post it on Facebook, um, but using random.org and I even took a little screenshot of it on my iPhone. It was the 79th comment, 1,579 people entered my contest. I don't even know if that's coming through on the webcam. Um, but anyway, you can see the glaring 79. So comment 79 was the winner. Um, and her YouTube screen name is I eat mutated babies 21. That doesn't sound very delicious. You shouldn't eat any more mutated babies. And another side note is all the Graveyard Girl shirts did go in the mail today. I dropped them off yesterday, but somebody told me that yesterday was also a postal holiday because like, I don't know if y'all noticed this, but like a bunch of places were still closed yesterday because like technically Sunday would be a holiday anyway. I guess for a lot of people. Okay, so now I'm gonna get to a point in my video. I really wanted to, on January 1st, upload a New Year's resolutions like tag, but I guess it's not a tag, it's just a video. I wanted to 
do that. But like, here I am, the third day of January, no one even cares anymore. But I thought maybe if I like espouse this into the world that I would have like more of a reason to do it. Um, Cause I am telling people that I'm gonna do it. I've never, ever, ever made a resolution before and I'm 26 years old, but I figured like, why the hell not? Um, I keep seeing this thing on Tumblr. It's so hilarious. It's like 2012, get rich or die Mayan. Oh, that's pretty witty. So I do have a couple of resolutions and I just thought I'd tell them to you guys so you can keep me in line. Um, my number one resolution is to work out every day. And I know everyone says this. It's like the saddest thing. Like they actually, I was in Walmart today and they actually, like you can tell it's the New Year's resolution line. Um, cause they have like, I don't know, slim trim or whatever like all these like pills are that you can buy legally over the counter uh, like ally or something uh they have like that on one side and then like hand weights and ab rollers on the other side so they're like that new year's resolution that you're not gonna keep all your necessities are down this aisle 1288 because you know everything in walmart ends in 88 it's never 99 it's 88 because they are rolling back 11 cents Oh my god, I just did that math in my head. High five! And I'm not talking like some crazy stuff. The number one thing that I'd like to do is like a little bit of an ab routine and then mostly like my arms because I used to have nice looking arms. I used to lift weights all the time and then like through all the tragedy of like getting my hand broken and whatever, like I just stopped doing things with life. Um, so I feel like my arms are like just kind of putrid right now so I really want to like lift weights and do like a little bit of maybe like cardio one day and then abs the next just like ding 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 um every other day so I can just be like a healthier person and I know like people are probably gonna be like no bunny or like give me some hate um because I mean it is true like I am thin but I don't like I'm not like toned so I'd rather not look like a bag of bones like I want to actually look like a human being my other biggest New Year's resolution is to do some writing every day because literally I've been a terrible person ever since I graduated from college. I'm just like, no, or I've just been like mainly focused on my screen printing business. So I just haven't been writing anything. Um, but I love keeping a journal and I used to be so good about it. I used to write in a journal every day and it's not just like, you know, that like, um, I don't know, like, dear diary, today I wanted a unicorn. My journal is like a captain's log, okay? I'm like Captain Kirk. Um, like, I write a little bit of kind of like what goes on. Um, maybe, unless it's like something like really, like none of y'all even care about this. I'm just like babbling now. See, this is just for myself. This is for myself, your captive audience, if you're watching this. I don't always just write about like what I did or what's up. Like, a lot of times it's more like I'll start writing like a little bit of a poem or an idea I have for a short story or something like that. And I feel even if I never bring any of those thoughts or ideas to fruition, it makes me feel better in my soul to at least be like, oh, that's a good idea. You know, and I can like flip back and be like, why don't you write it? So I don't know. That's like my biggest resolution besides like doing something <laughs> with my arms. I need to like punch people. I need to like get one of those punching bags. I always wanted one that looks like that clown. You know that bozo clown? So I could just be like, ugh, ugh. Like punch a clown, because I hate clowns. Clowns scare me. Clowns scare me so bad. Like if you send me a clown, I'll probably cry and peel my face off. It's just gonna happen. It's gonna be like, cry, peel. One, two. One, one two. I'm just gesticulating at this point. I really would like to vlog more. Can that be a resolution? I would love to vlog more. I would love to give in to my wants and needs inside of myself and create a vlog channel so I can just do this once a day. And there's not even like a month. There's not even like a group limbing activity that I can choose anymore, like Vlogmas. Cause I don't think anyone's doing Vlogannuary. Like that's not even even, even that's not even easy to say. It's like, happy Vlogannuary. We're doing it. What else was my resolution? I really want to get more organized too. I know that that's like something that everyone says, but I think that that's once again, like I love making lists. Like I want to do that. I want to get on like the life plan. I need to join Jenny Craig or something. Like I want to get on like a life schedule. Look, I'm not even organized in my thoughts or how I'm presenting this idea. I'm on a crazy life pattern and I feel like sometimes I need to stop. Um, Like I love staying up really, really stupid late and then like kind of waking up later and 
the day. But like sometimes I'm just like, no, that's bad. Sometimes I wish I could like wake up at 1030 and like go for a jog or like something like that. Um, I'd probably break my knees, but like go for a walk, like a fast paced walk, like a Richard Simmons walk. Just strap some peacock feathers on my butt and walk down the street like that. I don't know. I kind of wish I could like develop a routine because I feel like I'd be a healthy person if I like woke up at 1030, Richard Simmons peacock walked, and then like drank a smoothie. Like I feel like I'd be a healthier person. Can you already tell I'm breaking these? Can you already tell as I'm saying it out of my mouth that it's just not gonna happen. Also, I got a big stack of mail from you guys in like the last two weeks. So I'm gonna do like a stalker Wednesday, probably because I'm just so stoked to make a video on all the mail that I've gotten. Um, I guess I don't really have any more New Year's resolutions. Oh, I do. I have one, but I can never figure out how to make this dream come true. Um, I've always wanted to start like not even a full blown charity because I'm not like that lofty in my thinking. Um, but I've always wanted to to somehow get involved with helping the elderly. And I've always thought about trying to make these little like, uh, not really gift bags, but just like, you know, like companies give out samples and stuff like shampoos and soaps or even like getting donations of like shampoos, soaps, like just like necessities or little things, you know, like perfume samples and stuff. Um, and like donate them to like, um, nursing homes and stuff like that. Uh, I have no idea how to do it. So, but like, that's something I'd really like to do. Like maybe even on a really, really small scale by the conclusion of 2012. I'm going to try and really like feel better and record the Stalker Wednesdays, um, shout out mail opening video later tonight. Um, right now I'm going to go like drink some more ginger ale and play the trivia game on my Twilight Zone DVDs a little bit more. So far, like, the only, like, super productive thing I've done this year is, like, reorganize my keychains on my car keys. So I feel like a real winner. But due to just, like, being a loser and being ill, I haven't done any of my other resolutions yet. So I'm still just pretending, like, this is December. This is December, you guys. It's December 34. It's December 34th. So I'm gonna need you all to catch up. And we can start January tomorrow, when I can be more productive. So today is not January. Take those days back. Take them back. This is so sad. It's just sad. Um, anyway, well, I'm gonna go. <laughs> I don't know what else I was gonna say. It's gonna be so witty, though. It's gonna be, I'm so witty. Isn't that like a bad musical? Where they're like, I'm so witty and na na and fun. That's why I'm not on Broadway, because I can't, I can't sing, I can't sing. That should be a resolution though, because I love to sing, but I'm scared to sing in front of people. So I should get over that this year. I should just make it happen, but I doubt if I will, because I'm not that courageous. I'm just not, I'm not, I'm not. Look at my hair. My hair is so much fun now. I'm like those dolls. Did you ever have those dolls in the 90s? And like they made noise in their head. This sounds so crazy. They had like long necks and little soft, squishy, fat bodies, and like kind of long arms, and like mohawk hair, and you like shook them like either side to side, and they were like <laughs> If you were not alive in the 90s and you didn't have one of these dolls and you just don't know what I'm talking about right now, I'm just seem more crazier than usual. Um, but I'm like one of those dolls, because every time you shook their head, it was like <laughs> Like all this like troll hair that they just like took off of trolls when they stopped selling trolls and they just glued it onto these. As usual, please take a moment to subscribe. That was all just one thing. Uh, if you want, you can comment down below and let me know how your New Year's is going. Let me know if you killed your phone. Now it's in a bag of rice. You can like me on Facebook, facebook.com slash graveyard girl. Next time I drop my phone in a cup of soda, you'll know what's going on. Um, or you can follow me on Twitter. There I am at graveyard girl. Same as it is here. Uh, yeah. And I will see you guys later. Bye guys.